At first this half hour, Dayton International Airport says it's worried about its financial future because of the pandemic. It's warning that cuts, furloughs, or layoffs could happen if another stimulus pack package is not passed by lawmakers in Washington. Deputy Director Gil Turner says the airport is currently working with other airline industry leaders in lobbying Congress for more financial support. Earlier this year, you recall workers at Air Wisconsin and HMS host at the Dayton Airport were either furloughed or laid off. Turner says, though, the bills still need to be paid despite the slowdown. We really need to uh, focus on uh, infrastructure, uh, payroll to make sure that we can pay our, our employees to keep our employees uh, employed here at the airport. Also to pay our debt service and our operating expenses to cover. And perfect timing, just today the airport got more than $6.4 million from the Federal Aviation Administration for safety and infrastructure expenses.